Well, you've all watched it on the show, the invention test on MasterChef. And here at MasterChef Live over the weekend, people can come down and try it out. And today, yeah, it's my turn. I've got no idea what I'm going to do with this. I've got chicken breasts, I've got wine, I've got mascarpone, and some tandoori paste. Well, I've got to get my juices thinking before I start. I'm going to be counted down by host Andy Peters. And if I am really good, then I'm going to get through to the final three to meet Greg and John. So with the intense beats blaring out and a studio audience, yeah, it really was like the pressure on the show. And I was totally comfortable with my new innovative invention. So what are you giving me that for? I, no, no need for that at all. You're trusting me here. Some sort of uh, chicken-y, stroganoff-y... Uh, well, no, it's going to be chicken and cheese with bacon on rice with a bit of broccoli and white wine. So not strong enough at all, really. I'm going to throw that in at the end. I call it the um, ooh-la-la -la chicken extravaganza, personally. I uh, like the fact it rhymes, the ooh-la-la -la chicken extravaganza. I, I had to make extravaganza into a different word to make it right. Last thing. Well, like, it'll just... I think, I think we should probably put it in a little bit earlier. Yeah. 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 So I think we'll take or cut it up a bit finer. What? Always listen to the professionals, that's what I thought, so I couldn't help but take his advice. And soon it was time to play up and see, well, whether the judges thought it was worthy of eating my dish. What? What? Not, not in the top four? God, not winner? I'm going to have to pull a few strings here. There's no way that Greg and John are getting away without tasting this. A bit of a... Bit of a dilemma, I had a lot of help with my sous chef, I have to say. Because? Probably quite cold. The chicken's overcooked. Sure. First mistake. Yeah. And put the broccoli and the chicken slightly over. Put the broccoli stone to take the flavour of the chicken. Okay. Drop your broccoli in last. Yeah. So do your chicken and drop your broccoli in last and just let it coat it, otherwise the flavour goes into like the broccoli. The flavour of the sauce. No, the sauce is really nice. So, but guys, there's nothing wrong with that. The three minutes less cooking wouldn't have sold. No, right. <laughs> well, I was too efficient, yeah. if anything. Well, so guys, you're going to be enjoying the weekend coming up. You're going to be here all weekend? Or all weekend. The next three days we're here. We live here, we drink here, sleep here, eat here. <laughs> and you really enjoy Marshall every year? Oh my God, look at us. We love it. We absolutely love it. Absolutely so let's get everyone down here over the weekend and enjoy your company and all um, the absolutely chefs as here as many well. people as you possibly can. Invention tests, stuff on stage, food producers. Just great fun. Great, great fun. And food. A little bit better than that. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you very much. Guys. It doesn't get tougher than this, does it? <laughs> no, not at all. Cheers, I'm really Nick. still sweating it out. Thank Thanks you very much. much. Cheers, guys. Thank you. I was right. Put the broccoli in last. <laughs>